to take a look at meiosis and mitosis. So a pretty brief video and brief uh, topic that's covered in this exam, but uh, important um, and some stuff you really need to know. So these questions we will look at right now and then also put them up at the end to see if you can answer these questions. Um, basic processes of meiosis and mitosis, we definitely want to know that. Uh, anaphase 1 of meiosis. A uh, question about crossing over results in more genetic diversity. Is that true? Um, anaphase and mitosis, uh, purpose of cytokinesis in a cell. Uh, to what? Okay. Let's hop right in. So most of the body's cells are produced through mitosis, which is a process of cell replication that results in two identical daughter cells from a single parent. The number of chromosomes remains the same as the parent, which is 46, and this is a diploid cell. Meiosis results in four cells, with each containing a single copy of each chromosome, a haploid. Meiosis is a type of cell division that reduces the number of chromosomes in the parent cell by half and produces four gamet cells. This process is required to produce egg and sperm cells for sexual reproduction. Oops, a little too far. Uh, when genetic material is exchanged between homologous chromosomes, which is crossing over during meiosis, the result is more genetic combinations, which results in genetic diversity. So you remember we did have a crossing over question. Uh, third one down, right in the middle there. During meiosis, crossing over results in more genetic diversity. Uh, true or false? Uh, right, so more genetic combinations. And so more genetic diversity, so true. Okay, a big, a big slide here. Anaphase, prophase, telophase, and metaphase. Looks like the last part of metaphase at the bottom got uh, ran off the screen, so I'll just uh, tell you guys that when we get there. Uh, so anaphase 1 begins with two chromosomes uh, separate and start moving towards opposite poles of the cell as a result of the action of the spindle. In anaphase 2, the sister chromatids separate and the centromere is split, which causes the chromatids to separate. Uh, prophase is the first stage of cell division, and in both mitosis and meiosis. Beginning after interphase, DNA has already been replicated when the cell enters prophase. The main occurrences in prophase are the condensation of the chromatin, and the disappearance of the nucleolus. During telophase, the spindle disintegrates, the nuclear membranes reform, and the chromosomes revert to chromatin. And finally, uh, chromosome pairs align along the center of the spindle structure during uh, metaphase, which that's the part there that got uh, didn't quite make it there on the bottom of the screen. And while we I don't believe have a screen about this um, just because we ran out of room here. Cytokinesis is the splitting of the cytoplasm. This happens once the cell is ready to divide. So it is important that you know just the basics about cytokinesis and that involves a splitting of the cytoplasm. Okay, and with that we get to our questions, right? So we have five questions that uh, would be great if you try to answer uh, these now. And if you're lost with any parts of it, we went over each of these uh, concepts in this short video. Just go back, uh, find where we talk about it so that you know uh, the answer to these questions as you're heading into your exam.